Welcome to the new how to video guide from TechPosts. This video shows how to install exposed framework in Android Lollipop devices. After a tease earlier this week, exposed has finally been made compatible with Android Lollipop. But this time the installation is a bit different at least for now. This Lollipop compatible build is in its earliest stages of development right now, so bugs are to be expected, but I'll show you how to install it in this video guide. Requirements, rooted ARM v7 plus Android device. Custom recovery installed. Unknown sources enabled. Step 1 Download necessary files. There are two core elements to exposed one is the exposed framework, which lays all of the groundwork, and the other is the exposed installer app, which allows you to download and manage modules. You can download these files by following the links in the description. Step 2 Boot into Custom Recovery When the files have finished downloading, the next step is to boot into Custom Recovery. To do that, start by powering your device completely off. This next part may vary, but for most devices, press and hold the volume down and power button simultaneously. This will bring up Android's bootloader menu. From here, use the volume down button to highlight recovery mode, then press the power button to select it. Step 3 Install the framework in custom recovery. Before you flash anything in custom recovery, it's always a good idea to make a full Nanroid backup. That's extra important in this case, since the exposed framework is in its early stages, and may cause issues with some devices. Do not skip this step. The framework should only be flash on devices with ARM v7 or ARM v8 processors. If you're unsure about this, Check your phone's documentation, or look for the spec sheet on a website like gsmarena.com. Now go ahead and tap the install button from TWRP's main menu. Next, navigate to your device's download folder, then select the exposed ARM zip file. After that, just swipe the slider at the bottom of the screen to install the framework, and when that's finished, tap Reboot System. Your device will take longer than normal to boot up here. This is because the exposed framework zip had to clear away some library files, which will need to be restored. Expect this process to take at least 10 minutes. Step 4 Install the exposed installer app. When you get back up, it's time to install the actual exposed installer app. Tap the download complete notification for the exposed installer 3.0 alpha 2 up file, then press install and open on the next two menus. At this point, you should be looking at that familiar exposed interface we all know and love. Head to the download section to begin browsing modules, but keep in mind that some may not work on Lollipop. Any modules that deal with system modification are not working properly, while those that deal with app customization are working for the most part. For a list of modules that are known to be working with Lollipop, check out the description below. Please subscribe us for more such how-to guides, and see our other popular, how-to guides on Android, Windows and Linux. Thanks for watching.